tonight's episode of Emma Dale saw Lachlan, played by Thomas Atkinson, one step closer to being caught. The diabolical teen started his ing spree by crashing the car which held his mother, Chrissy White, Louise Marwood, and his grandfather Lawrence White, John Bow. He ultimately got away with his heinous acts after it was revealed his sister Rebecca White, Emily Head, did not remember the event. Since then, fans have been wondering when Lachlan would slip up and get caught. His undoing began after Jerry Roberts, Sean Thomas, was in possession of the voicemail which depicted the White family being aired at the hands of Lachlan. This brutal audio file was eventually deleted, but not before Lachlan revealed what he had done to his family. Jerry's knowledge led to his horrific death at the hands of Lachlan. When he collapsed part of a derelict building on him and crushed his head with a piece of rubble. Tonight's episode may be the beginning of the end for Lachlan, as Liv Flaherty, Isabel Steele finds Jerry's sketchbook. The book shows off some of Jerry's comics which depicts Lachlan's actions on the road which aired his family. Although just drawings, could they lead to the end of Lachlan's tyranny? When Liv presents this sketchbook to Terry, Daniel Casey, Lachlan is understandably horrified. He instantly began pestering Terry for the book, but to no avail. Will Lachlan be left to plot out a way to steal the book from Terry before he reads the horrifying truth inside? Or will Liv realize what she has already read and go to the police to report it? Either way, this new spanner in the works may lead to Lachlan striking out and murdering yet another member of the village. Lachlan's story continues after the Ofcom complaints surrounding Jerry's death were rejected. The scenes garnered more than 100 complaints last month. Viewers complained about the graphic nature of Jerry's death, leading to an investigation by the TV regulator. The company dismissed the claims as they found no graphic details were shown on screen. Emmerdale continues tomorrow at 7 p.m. on.